Good morning children. Welcome to the online computer class. I am Preeti Kumar. Before we start, let us observe two minute silence to pray for the peace within and outside and also pray for everyone's well-being. Open your eyes children. Let's get started. As you know children, we have done tables and forms in HTML. We have done many of the tags. Now, we are going to do some more tags and attributes of table. Learning in this chapter, we have learned about creating a table, caption tag, attributes of body tag, in the body tag only you have learned about BG color, top margin, left margin, attributes of table tag, border, border color, BG color, align, cell padding, cell spacing and today we are going to learn about height and width of table. This is the attribute of table tag. With this only, we are going to learn about attributes of TR, TD and TH tag. Already we have done BG color, border color and now today we are going to do spanning. In the spanning, we have two more attributes called span and row span. Then align and under the line horizontal alignment and vertical alignment what is horizontal alignment alignment align attribute controls the text alignment within the cell contents horizontally it values its value can be left center or right as you see in this picture by default Alignment of the content of table cell is left in the first row. In the second row, if you want, you can set it to center or right. If you want to change the alignment of cells, it has to be done individually for each cell. Syntax, TR, align, left, center, right. If you want to use with TR, you can use align with TR also. Even you can use with TD also. So TD align is equal to center. Here the example I have taken as a center. Vertical alignment. V align attribute is used with TD tag. Vertical alignment we write as a V align and sets the vertical alignment of data in a document. The data can be set to top, middle or bottom. As you see in the picture, in the cell you can set it as a top, middle or bottom. By default it is always middle. Syntax TD V align is equal to top, middle, bottom. An example TD V align is equal to top. Top is a value. Spanning. You can combine two or more cells either column wise or row wise to convert them into single cells. It is useful for displaying heading and titles in consecutive rows and columns. Call span it is used only with TD tag. Call span is used to combine cells horizontally. It specifies the number of columns that the cell span across and merge them into a single cell. As you see in this table, here student details, student details is uh, in the single cell means these three columns are merged together. 
to form a single cell. Syntax TD call span is equal to 3. 3 is the value means you have merged 3 columns where 3 is the number of columns that the cell span across. Row span it is used with TD tag. Row span is used to combine cells vertically. It merges the number of cells vertically and displays them as a single cell. As in this table you can see the class 7 is here. So this these rows are merged vertically. So here Call in the call span, columns are merged. In the row span, rows are merged in a single cell. Syntax TD row span 3, where 3 is the number of rows that the cell span across. So this way, children, now we will see how we will write the coding for it. Thank you.